Ciao ragazzi and welcome to another video with Lemonis. Just an apartment and that was really nice and we liked it and um, a year or let me say eight months later we purchased our house and two months ago we moved into our house now I would sit here I don't want to lie I have to be honest I think maybe we were doing stuff way too fast because obtaining an apartment and a house in a very short time it's huge financial responsibilities when we got an apartment we still didn't know that we were going to be parents very soon and then uh, a few months maybe a month later or so we discovered we were expecting and we thought okay we would need a bigger space for sure and that's when we got the house enough space for the whole family five rooms so we have like the moment like four bedrooms we can convert one of the bedroom into an office and that's beautiful but um maybe we were not ready for all the financial responsibility that comes with owning two properties in a very very short time because when we moved in we didn't expect that we we're going to move out as soon very fast two months is very very fast considering that we had to pick up everything there but when we moved into a house and then two months later we were really moving out and it's quite stressful knowing that you just you are already moving out of your place after you just moved in in two months if Ali was here with me we would just say we have made the right decision but I personally feel like maybe we could have waited longer or maybe we could have thought about what we're doing a little bit more before taking a decision to buy a house in a very short time just after buying um after buying an apartment and i think you know in this world that we live in and sometimes we just really caught up in the thrill of i feel we were more caught up in a in an idea of oh my goodness we had because we knew we wanted a house since i would say five years ago but um, maybe we're more caught up in the idea of we want to tick this off our list as fast as possible and we didn't fully um, thought and analyze the financial responsibility and burden that comes with owning a house. Owning an apartment is already, it comes, you have to pay a lot. But a house is a whole lot more because in an apartment you have the whole building that you share with your other owners. And when you have a house, you have to pay everything by yourself, from from gardening, everything by yourself. I don't think we really understood until we moved in the house that we would need way more than what we thought. Now, when we bought the house, we liked it, and we knew that it was going to need some renovation. And again, and again here we are today. I think we underestimated it. How much to take and uh, how fast the house would need to be renovated so we are now currently in a rental for maybe about uh, 10 days we'll see if it's everything goes to plan we're going to be here about 10 days and on the 11th day we're going back home um renovation needed to be done the soonest the soonest like yesterday just because we are now four people in the house and we needed uh everything functional from bedroom kitchen at the moment there's work done just to renovate the ground floor and make sure it's suitable and appropriate for us as a family because that's where we spend most of our time especially on weekends and evening after work living room kitchen we have ordered a beautiful kitchen i hope everything is going to look well i'm excited but i'm also concerned the way we're just spending our finance at the moment house is I mean, seriously, like uh, we are doing completely new tiling. We like wanted new tiles. We had like a before the fake wood and stuff. But Ali, you know, as an architect, didn't like that. I was like, no, we have to go for something real. Or we will start calling and dropping things everywhere. So it's just best if we have uh, normal solid tiles. And then we're getting a kitchen and 
yeah the whole way that maybe we love kind of uh, under evaluated uh, how much money we would need to put in the property to make it whole and how fast we would need to do that and that is the sad part and mm, it's a little bit stressful on that part but yeah because then renovating also meaning you're moving out of your house and then you're in a rental a rental also because my guess you know whole family in a rental for 10 days is just not easy and hmm, here we are i'm hoping for the best i hope everything's going to be fine um like ali would always say this is probably the most challenging project we have taken together as a couple um yeah let's see how it goes and that's just the beginning and i think they will have to do more innovation to really uh, transform this property that we bought into home but yeah so we are now in a rental the rental is beautiful has been renovated i'm giving my fingers crossed ali is going to the house pretty much every single day to check how things are going because we really want to make sure that at the end everything is done the way we want it to be done and we don't have to redo it okay it's also not bad thing to just rent your apartment i'm being honest you don't have a lot of responsibility when it comes to maintaining a property and it just is on your mind you don't have to think about gardening or cleaning of leaves like we've been doing the past three or four weeks when autumn started we have one big tree in the garden uh you don't have all that and i was i was happy just paying my rent and that was it and everything else in the garden uh, maintaining the building outside painting was done then now as a um, homeowner we have to think about every single thing from gardening trash things i just was never thinking about when i was renting or when i owned an apartment so for that i would say mm, it, it is also just fine and relieving maybe just you don't have unnecessary responsibility you don't always have we thought about it through a little bit longer maybe we would have just settled with having an apartment for the benefit of um you have to share most of the cost with your owner with the with the other owners that are sharing the building with, with the building with you and everybody gone for a short walk or bicycle riding all the fun and i'm sitting here just chilling and reflecting on decisions we have made it's, it's a sunday thing for me and then after this i'll prepare for monday and prepare lunch for Olivia. If you enjoy this kind of video, let us know. Maybe we can do a little bit more financing on how we... It's a topic that we are always passionate about. And I think as a couple, no matter how tense it is to discuss about money and finances, you always have to take decisions together. And if you would like to hear that from us, we would still do a couple of series about finances we like, we love. We are very passionate about managing finances as a family because we think we try our best. But, you know, we also make mistakes. We are learning as we are going through life. And if you would like to see the outcome of the house, how it's going to be, Ali is referring to it every single time as our new home, our new home. Like, we are only renovating the ground floor. But, yeah, if you are interested in seeing how the outcome is going to be, leave that in the description box. And then we will show you how everything is going to be. And... Pray for me, I need prayers. I need I need that project to really work out. Like, I just don't want to remove more construction to get things redone. No, I'm just hoping that they do it once and it's done in the best way possible so we don't have to work on that the next five years. If you enjoy this, give us a like, subscribe to our channel. If you want to see more of our video, keep watching and check maybe one of the playlists up here. And thank you so much for always supporting us. Sometimes I come here and I don't feel energetic at all. It's a, since I got a child, my energy level is... Mm -hmm, especially on weekend, because weekends are the only time I have in those times. Weekend, I divide between uh, doing YouTube, which is like uh, my hobby, a mini project I started many years ago, and uh, spending time with Olivia. So sometimes my energy level is uh, slightly off. But I appreciate your support and your laugh and all your beautiful comment critics. I should improve, I know. Sometimes I'm just filming really fast. I want to share stuff that I don't have time and I'm filming just really fast and maybe the quality is compromised. Yeah, that was very much it from me. See you in our next video.
Tchau, tchau, tchau.